four million dollars. Oh of course god. they fucking do. Oh my <laughs> god. Oh, of course they do. Why? What's good, YouTube? It's your boy. Big Rebecca the brand new. React. Before you get started, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, man. Leave a comment. Oh, what else you want me to react to? Logan Paul buys the world's most expensive Pokemon car, $5.3 million. Holy shit. That's a lot of money, man. That's a lot of money. It's an illustrator card, as usual. No Charizard, man. You know, this makes a Charizard look like a baby. I think a Charizard's like, what, a million, two million dollars? This card right here is $5.3 million. It's a very, very expensive card. Y'all know what an illustrator is it's by the creator man it's literally by the creator of pikachu man you know if y'all live under a rock um it looks like logan paul purchased it man so we gonna see i don't know if this is clickbait or cat but looks it looks entertaining you know what i'm saying i love pokemon man you know comment down below what y'all favorite pokemon is mom personally i'll say dark eyes pretty dope brought on and kyogre are dope but my favorite original will always be charizard without further ado man we're gonna see what's going on you know logan paul is a very wealthy youtuber slash boxer slash wrestler now you know what i'm saying he's in the ww Please leave a like, comment, subscribe for your new man. Let's get it. Let's go. And the 10? No one knows. It is the only one in perfect condition, and at this point, it's just a rumor. There are no pictures or videos of this card online, anywhere. And no one I know has ever even seen it. Damn. Until one day in February 2021. <laughs> I may have an opportunity to purchase the one and only PSA 10 Pikachu Illustrator in the world. No shot. Why is it a mite? Some guy hit me up on Instagram. Mm. He said, hey buddy, I just had a very reputable person message me the most crazy Pokemon card in the game that he wants to sell. It's a PSA 10 Pikachu Illustrator card. The only one in the world that's a PSA 10. There's no chance, bro. I've heard stories about this card. It was bought by a wealthy family, and I guess they might be willing to sell it at this point. How much is too much for this card? I would go four. Four? No, 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 right at two, right at two. Four. Two million. Yeah. Two million on okay. four million dollars. Oh, of course they fucking do. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, of course they do. Let me call my people. I really want it. <laughs> Something's crazy. Yeah, uh, it's nuts, man. Big, uh, big bucks, dude. He is highly significant considering your offer. Fucking wild dog. <laughs> like, yo. What'd you, wait, wait, say that one more time. I said I have some bad news for you. Why? After she said that after sleeping on it, um, he doesn't want to sell anymore. Damn, that sucks. Well, that was short-lived. <laughs> I'm gonna pause it real quick, man. I mean, he has some time to think about it. You know, he obviously knows the value of the car, whoever the seller is. You know what I'm saying? He obviously knows. He obviously knows he can get a lot of money. It's literally the only PSA 10 in the world. Imagine having an object, right? And it's literally the only object in the world. That would be fucking insane. You know what I'm saying? That's literally insane. So yeah, and especially if it's so high demand and everybody wants it, obviously. You know, yeah, it's gonna go for some money, man. You know what I'm saying? He wants four million dollars this day. Now he doesn't want to sell it anymore because he probably knows he can get more he's probably like oh if i can get it to four million i can probably get it to like six million five million seven million you know what i'm saying so we'll see what happens man you know let's continue <laughs> it's all good i don't even, i don't even want it anymore man i'm dead <laughs> you want it this is the second time i've been within harm's reach of the pikachu illustrator and i failed <laughs> Oh, it's not over yet. I hope. <laughs> well, four months went by and I still couldn't stop thinking about the card. So I said, F it reached out to a friend of mine named Jeremy, an expert collector who knew the mysterious seller and was somehow able to reignite the conversation, but with a catch. And the price is six million dollars. Four months ago, he was yeah. asking for four million dollars. The second option is we find a PSA 9 and then he would give us a $2 million credit. $6 million or $4 million and maybe like a $1 million card. Mm -hmm. All we gotta do but now you gotta buy. is find the Pikachu Illustrator PSA 9. <laughs> but hold on, let me pause it real quick. But now you gotta spend a shit ton of money getting the 9 just to trade it in to get money off of... So you're, it's a losing, losing money either way. You're not gaining anything. You're literally losing money Either way you put, I mean, technically, I guess, as far as value goes for the, I'm so ashy, bro. Hold on. 
Anyway, as far as money goes, man, it's a lose-lose situation. You gotta buy a nine to get the 10, just to get money off of the 10, and still have to buy it at $4 million. God knows how much a nine is, because it's literally one number under 10. Fuck, man, that's a lot of money. It's like seven, six, seven million dollars total. Anyway, you know what I'm saying? Either fucking way you put, but whatever. I guess that's, uh, I guess that's how shit works. If I'm doing this math right, I don't know. Let's continue. How hard can it be, right. bro? <laughs> Apparently not that hard. My network of collectors has become quite large, and after a few phone calls, I found one. So you found it. He wants one, two, five. One million, two hundred fifty thousand dollars. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, let's do it. That's a lot of money. So that means he spent five million then. Because if he, if he trades it in. As a collector. Four million, yeah, okay, so he spent five. Or about Pokemon trading cards, this is the first card you hear about. Holy fing shit. It's nice. Yeah, I wouldn't even risk that. Is that found motion? But how much in collectibles are in this room right now? We have at least 15 million. Wow. Fifteen million dollars worth. <sighs> but you love Pikachu. Yeah, he's the best, bro. What is this, bro? This is sick. Are they hand drawn by Mitsuhiro? <laughs> Holy fucking shit. That's dope. That was right worth a lot, too. Now it's my turn, boys. <laughs> now it's my turn. <laughs> As part of the deal, I uh, was able to a lot secure of a PSA 9. <laughs> I also have, this is an IOU, $4 million. <laughs> this is I'm monumental, dead. this is historical, this will never happen again. This is going to be the biggest collectible deal ever done in history. <sighs> I don't know if I'm ready for this. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy, man. That's an expensive oh, card. No, it did not. A custom ever case. That's hard. Oh my god. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the moment we've all been waiting for. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. What was thought to once only be a myth yeah. is now sitting in front of me inside of a custom Maverick case. <laughs> That is insane. <laughs> That's fucking crazy. Ten. Oh man, it's literally perfect. That's nuts. Logan! Wow. That's the one you wore. That's funny he was on WWE. I'm with uh, Guinness World Records. I'm an official adjudicator. And I can tell you the following. The most expensive Pokemon trading card sold at a private sale is a PSA Grade 10 Pikachu Illustrated card. $5,275,000 on July 22nd. The way he said it, bro. What the you hell? You are officially amazing. Congratulations. You are new. Let's go. This is the coolest thing ever, but it's, it's even insane. cooler that you, yes, you at home, can own this card with me. Right into the plug. Right <laughs> Damn, man, well, I'm gonna stop it there. That is insane. That's a very, very expensive motherfucking Pokemon card. Personally, I mean, it's at the end of the day, it is an investment, but I don't know if that's an investment I'm willing to take. It's such a small object, and not only, not only is it a small object, it is a physical object. It's not digital. It's not somewhere that can just be saved, copied. Like, that's a one of one. You know, somebody steals that, it's gone. Gone. It's gone, <laughs> you know, and that's their card. It's gone, man. So, you know, I don't know. I don't think I could do it, man. I don't think I can invest that much money. But comment down below, man, if you ever would. You know what I'm saying? I would definitely invest that much money. Not into a Pokemon card, though. As much as I love Pokemon, y'all. But hope y'all enjoyed this reaction, man. This is my boy, Big Rick. Big Rick TV. We going to the top, and we out. Peace. <laughs>